Hi everybody, it's Julie and I have a heavy box haul from the post office box. And this one is from Carolyn and um, she is a subscriber here on my YouTube channel and also a member in Scrap All About It. And she sent me this huge box and this beautiful card with the quilling on it. Isn't that pretty? Um, I have um, a poem called The Swing and I think I'm going to be doing a, a book on it. She said I can use um, the items in this box in my personal and in my stash. And she sent me a letter. Um, she had to cut the 12 by 12 papers to fit in the box. Um, there's some reproduction labels. I can fussy cut them and use them for the garden journals or dot, dot, dot. <laughs> um, there's faceted bling. There's notepads. She had, there's so many pages. I told, yeah, um, that she can't use it all. And then the lace was inherited. I can't wait to get to this lace from my grandmother. It is from a sewing factory bolt and is from the thirties. She said she still, she keeps using it. She still has half the bolts. So she shared some of that and she bought the eyelet at Goodwill. It was a bed skirt and she thinks there was like 30, almost 30 yards of it. Cause it was a really tight, um, ruffle. And so that's in there. And, um, she said that she finally understands layering. Yay. Um, okay. So I'm really excited. That was totally paraphrasing this letter. Um, I did open it up and, and then also there was this stamped unicorn in here as well. Isn't that cute? And the, the little bag is cut in a scallop. I like that. Very, very, very cute. Okay, so I'm going to set the big heavy box over here on the side and reach in and grab out of it because otherwise I won't be able to, to reach underneath. Ah, the kettle bug has to be little. There. Okay. Oh. Oh, 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 look at these. So here are some of the, um, they kind of look like they might be dragonflies, but they're, um, the lacy cutout pages and there's a few of them in there in the off white. And there's a few in this one. Oh, that is really pretty. Very cool. Those lacy, lacy. Oh. Oh, I love this. Now this is something I would hoard. <laughs> I love this. So it's acetate with the um, roses around it. And the, the, eight, the 12 by 12, she said she had gotten it at Tuesday morning in those packages. That is going to be so much fun to play with. Some peach paper. Very cool. Ah, some more. I like these. I am going to be doing a lot more um, scrapbooking. I, I have to get through the scrapbooking stuff that I have. <gasps> Look at It's wallpaper. It's a wallpaper border and it's pansies. Oh my gosh. I That is so cool. You know what? I have a whole... I have a tub of wallpaper borders somewhere in the holiday shed. Hmm. So watch for those. They'll be showing up. Some spring napkins. I like those. I like those. That'll be fun to see how those do on the, the technique. Oh, okay. So this is the cork. She said that she had made these as Christmas presents. Um, and she signed it on the bottom. So, um, yeah, so this actually will go in my Christmas tree stuff and it'll go on my tree. Um, 
or it might go in the, the bathroom that I decorate blue. It's really pretty. I love this bead. Very, very pretty. I love it. And I know she said that she used some of this pink and blue stuff in the um, in her spring blossoms kit. Oh, look at this with the butterflies. That one's really cute, too. Oh, this must be that lace. Oh, wow. Look at this. Oh, gosh. That is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. One of the, oh my God, this is so pretty, Carolyn. Thank you so much for sharing that. I'm not going to put the rubber band on it. Thank you so much for sharing that with me. Oh, that is beautiful. It will be hard for me to use that, <laughs> but I will. I will. Um, my, my grandkids are going to be here for the week. One of the projects I have is we're going to take the lace from when I went to Ben Franklin and I bought all that lace. It needs to be put on to the cardboard. I just found that that's um, a way that I, I use things much, much easier is um, when the lace is on the cardboard. So uh, we'll, we'll be doing that this while they're here. Oh, <gasps> look. At, oh, my gosh. Well, this is hanging up in my craft room. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. Look at all of the, the different laces. And it's got this trim that goes around it. And I think it's cork also. Oh, that is stunning. Absolutely, absolutely stunning. Just just beautiful and look at all the different kinds of trims in there and bling and pearly things i just got a bunch of these um in, in a goodwill haul and some pieces of material look at this pink trim that's beautiful this is gorgeous this is going somewhere it'll go somewhere up here where i can see it but it very very it goes with my um with the decorated part of my office craft room. Very, very much. Beautiful, Carolyn. That is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I know where this is going. This will show up, probably show up in the next kit. This is really cute. I never saw these ones. I never saw these. Those are really cute. Oh, look at those. I love, I, uh, I love flowers. Could be why I was a florist. Oh, see, now I got the big ones. But I didn't see the little ones. I got the big the big ones. And I, I got them because they, they do have flowers on all four. Whoops. Okay, that's a whole bunch of dyes just fell off. <laughs> I'm trying to do, like, all my stuff before my company gets here. And it's all stacked. My stuff is stacked all around me. So, but those are beautiful. And these could be fussy cut. They'll be great with the packing tape method. Thank you so much for sharing those with me. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at the pink. Oh, got flowers on this side and got a, an adorable pink ladybug on that side. Wow. See, this just means I, I need to get to... Oh! I must be the most spoiled. Look at... Look at these fairies. Look at those fairies. So you get in a panel. There's one, two, three, four. Oh my goodness. This is gorgeous. Oh, I can't wait. Cannot wait. I have. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Carolyn. <laughs> this is going to be a hard one to decide what your favorite is. Or it's gonna, I think. And some more wallpaper border. I think I might have. This might be in the, one of the wallpaper kit. The, I have a couple of the wallpaper books, and they're from this. This is definitely vintage. 
and they are from this era. I love this. I have I have some material that will go with this really, really well. I'm hoping to do uh, what to do, like I've done with the 12 by 12 paper and the 8.5 by 11 paper, what to do with a fat quarter of material for junk journals. <gasps> so this is the eyelet. Look at this. And it is two-sided. She mentioned that in the th in her um, thing. Wow. <laughs> she has almost 30 yards of it. And there's a bunch in there. Uh, yeah, I am most spoiled. <gasps> Holy guacamole! <laughs> this is bling heaven! <laughs> bling heaven! Look at this! Red and blue, and look at this with all the different colors, like mermaid colors. Look at this! Look at this. Oh my gosh, I have to see that one down there. You guys, I haven't, this is like just a little layer off the top here. I hope I have enough battery to do this whole thing. Actually, I did plug in. Uh oh, I broke, I, I ripped the bag. I'm too excited. I just, I want to see this when it's at the bottom. Look at that. So, this is the faceted bling. So, it's bling. But it's a hole, so it's not like you're going to lose your bling. I love it. I cannot believe how much is in there. And it's, that's heavy. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, there's Monday's, um, <laughs> Monday's card. <laughs> okay, so next is playing cards. And their lighthouse and their ocean. Oh, look at it. With the geese. So it might not be, it might be a, a, one of the really big lakes. Oh, these are beautiful. And I have, I have stuff coming up. Oh, this is like, I can't tell you how exciting this is. <gasps> look at these. Money cards, money flash cards. Look at, and then on this side it shows you, oh, these are awesome. Won't those look so cool in a book, in a journal? Oh, wow. There's some more bling. That's my mom's favorite color right there. Isn't that pretty? I'm going to put it in here. Okay, which way do we go? There's so much stuff in here. So, a couple of Christmas money cards. I like using these and then putting something else in this back. Um, in my, my stuff. I'm going to put Christmas up here. Oh, wow. Okay, so this is note cards. So there's this one, and there's this one. Holy back roll. And there's this one. Wow, wow. <laughs> then there's, I, I love this one, homegrown. Life is an amazing journey. Shine like stars. Let's do this. Miracles are all around us. I'm so bummed. I found a bedspread that was very much like this, but like from the 60s. And I, I didn't put it in my basket when I was at the Goodwill. And I, um, oh, that is so cool. But this, it's got teal in it. It will, and miracles, it's going to be really, really awesome in my prayer journals. And look at this. Oh my gosh. Awesome. And green. 
Oh, and these have been fun. I, I, I did a video in the spring blossom where I got one of these and I, um, I used the circle out of it. Oh my gosh. So this is going right over here because I think this will match the, um, perfectly. Like this is like so perfect for the, um, pinup girl stuff I've been saving. So it's going right there with the pinup girl stuff. And then a cute little butterfly and make today amazing. All this peach stuff. Oh. So here are some more. Um, oh, these are. What do these do? They, they do some. Oh, they're tents. They're little. Um, you make a little sign. And so they're little tents. But of course they don't have to be that. They can be amazing cards or something else. Because you know we don't use things the way they're meant to be. And look with the feathers. And then this one with the... These are great. Oh, I like them. And they have the spiral in them. But she's taking them out of the spiral. So they... Very smart. So they're not going to get all yucky. That's so cool. Oh, look at little rainbow pad. And I have, where did I put, don't want to put it in the wrong place. There we go. Unicorns and rainbows go right there. I had them out. Okay, so the drinks are on the house. That is hilarious. That is hilarious. These look like these are old. These, oh my gosh. Look at the envelope for those. Thank you. An invitation and it's music notes. Always love music notes. Oh, kitty. And more kitties. Oh, but I love this kitty and his fish. Oh, you're one of my favorite people. This is going to go right up here. I don't get to have a kitty, many of you know, because my dog doesn't know how to play nice with them. He gets very upset when they stop moving, and we, and we only know that because it happened. It does not happen anymore, <laughs> but it was very sad. Oh, look at, look at. <laughs> Yeah, I love kitties. I love, oh, they're so cute. And that is beautiful. Very fun. And some more. A hummingbird. Very pretty. And look, at there's a hummingbird on the note, on the envelope as well. Friend love us at all time. I love that. That is a such a cute card. This one says thank you so much. So you can just put something across there. Oh, look at those birds. <laughs> this is amazing. There's just more and more and more. Oh, I love that. More and more and more stuff. Here we have some recipe cards. Look at the lemonade one. Very cute. Some little flower cards. I was going to say I can see something and look at, look at the inside of that envelope. Isn't that fun? So if you used a plain outside to make your envelope but then when you open it up, isn't that fun to have that surprise? I like that very much. Oh, I like these. Treasures by Shabby Chic. And these are the envelopes. Very cool. And there's more. So a whole package of those thank you so much. These are awesome. Look at that. Look at with the lace. 
very pretty. Oh, look at the rose. I miss having, I, <laughs> we don't have very many flowers right now or anymore because of the drought. Thanks be unto God for his unspeakable gift. Oh, see now look at you got the card here and then you open it up and surprise it's decorated on the inside isn't that neat always a smart idea and then you can decorate on the envelope too Just a couple more of the little pads let's see what do we got here oh look at this And another peach one. Oh, look at, oh, I've got the little one to this, but not, oh my goodness. This will go in the um, pinup girl stuff too. I have a little pad of this from, I got at CVS. I really like this. I like all of it. <laughs> How in the heck am I gonna use everything, you guys? I've got to get making stuff. Look at the Christmas tree card. And some envelopes. There's, oh, there's more cards in there. Okay, so there's Christmas tree, there's ornaments, and there's stripes. Those make a cute thing all in themselves. Christmas, they go up there. Oh, what do we have here? So these are Shabbylicious Collection Window and Shutter Die Cuts. Oh! It shows you how to use, make them and they become, they go on a tag or something. Very cute. Let's look at that real quick. Are we still, yeah, we're still filming. <laughs> They're still more in there. Wow. I'm feeling very spoiled. Very, very spoiled. Okay, so we have this. And then it has these little... Oh, look at these. Tags. Wow. So you get the little... The little die cuts and they're different they're different ones and these and then oh look at the chairs oh this is gorgeous oh yeah this might be mine <laughs> I keep that for me I like very much oh look at how pretty and this one Oh, these are gorgeous. I'm going to put this one in with the... It might match the, the girls over there. Look at this. Blues are so pretty. That one is so... They're all so pretty. Look at... Okay, we don't want to lose that. That's the directions. But you can use... I mean, all this watercolor stuff. And that would match the... Um, Placemats, the really pretty watercolor placemats that I've gotten in Ojai. Oh, and that one. I mean, everything has matches just enough that it would all go go together. Look at these. This looks a lot like those the flowers that were in the Target Easter confetti. Oh, yes. Oh wow. Here's a little bag. Little bag. And it has little roses cards. Oh, love them. And then this, that'll go in the... Oh my gosh, that, that will match. This will go with the... Yeah, it goes with this one. But it'll go with all of those for the um, <clears throat> pinup girls. And then some of the little um, 
index cards. I have some of these. They're light blue. I like this with the darker blue. Um, I know they were more expensive to buy them this way, but it's, it's really nice because they're already done. I love them. <clears throat> Is that not the cutest thing? I love <laughs> I love it. The little acorn. Love the little acorn. And then we have. Oh, look at these envelopes. They're stationary. No, they're envelopes. Just the envelopes. But look at those. Are they not gorgeous? They would be so pretty in the spring blossom kit. I bet she used it in her spring blossom. She does have a spring blossom kit, so I bet she used it in there. And some cardinal cards. I love cardinals. Thank you. We'll put that with Christmas. Okay, wow. Okay. We have this. Okay, there's more than one of that. We'll put that back. Um, so there are some cut-apart this one's a cut apart, and then there's some computer paper, a variety of them. Look at these. Oh, very cool. This is gorgeous. So this file folder, it's two double-sided with the vintage stuff and then the butterflies. There's two of those. And there are three of these. You know, these might match the pinup girl stuff too. And then, oh, this is awesome. Ah, oh, look at that. I, I think she talked about that in the in the letter. I think this, yeah. She talked about that I could fussy cut these and put them in my garden journals. I love that. Okay, now we're down to the 12 by 12 paper. She said she had to cut this. I totally get it. I'm not doing any more kits that are um, that have 12 by 12 paper unless it's cut because I don't want to have to cut it to put it in the, the kit or go to the next size. Okay, so here we go. We have three of these. And we can go ahead and fussy cut around those or fill in the frame. They are double-sided. I like this side better. And then these, oh my gosh, look at these roses. And thank you, you sent me the scraps too. Thank you. Look at this. She must have been you. Oh, these are, this is how she cut them. That's what, this is how she cut them to fit them in. That is so smart. That is so smart. Look at all these roses. Oh my goodness gracious. Love them. Oh, these are the label. Okay, these are the, the labels that she was talking about that I could cut up. Oh, I love them. Tooth powder, festive cake, <laughs> ah. table treat. These are cool. Some of these might be from where I grew up. <laughs> okay, we've got chocolate. A whole bunch of pages that say, okay, so they've got cake, and it says chocolate down here, and milk chocolate and sweet chocolate. These are beautiful. 
I love the colors. You know, one of the things that um, you want to remember, and I am at the bottom of the box. Yay! Oh my gosh, not yay that I'm at the bottom of the box, but yay that there's so much in it. Um, but when you look at a paper and you go, wow, I really like that, um, that you can pay attention and look at, at what colors were used in here. What is it about this that you like so much? Is it all the different textures? Do you like this the best? And um, so that you, and you, you can go, oh, um, and use this as like a start off point for something else that you're making. So, um, oh my gosh. So Carolyn, thank you so much. This was such a huge and heavy box and it was amazingly full of stuff. Um, I would love to know what everyone's favorite items were and what kits you would like to see come out of some of these really big hauls or not hauls but racks random acts of kindness I um, thank you so much for sharing with me Carolyn I can't wait to play with this and so I have to go get ready for company I hope you all are having a great day and that you find something to celebrate every day don't forget to subscribe Thank you again, Carolyn. I love it all. My very favorite is your grandmother's lace. And then everything else. <laughs> Have a great day. Bye. Thank you for being here.